focus. Aim, focus. Aim, focus. Oops. Fucking aim. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I forgot to do this. I guess for Christmas or whatever the hell. No, oh, fuck it. No, oh, fuck it. Okay. 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 There's the proper way to dismount a horse there. Red Dead Redemption 2 online. We got Trader, Bounty Hunter, and Collector in back in October. I recently maxed out all those. Got some good stuff. And the Wheeler and Rawson Club. Added another 100 ranks for that. Wheeler and Rawson, of course, is the fictional version of what would have been Sears and Roebuck at the time. About a week ago, they started the newest update. We now have the Moonshiner. I've done a few missions for it. This they call it the Navy Revolver. It's an 1860 single-action cap and ball Colt military issue. So far, it's been the best gun in the entire game. I wish it came out a year ago because. It really gets things done. There's still a few basic glitches that really piss me off, especially regarding weapons and randomly equipping weapons that you don't want to have equipped. A bug they should have fixed a year ago, but they did add this quick select, which has been really effective. These new guns, they've got the range, the accuracy. It usually doesn't take more than two shots to kill anyone. But that might be because I've got all my abilities upgraded. Following the smoke. That's where they're gonna be. Fuck me! I just realized it was time to mission. I got two minutes to drop all these revenue agents. Okay, so I'm not going to snipe. I'm going to go in Confederate, Gorilla, Jesse James style. It'd be awesome if you could carry more. <laughs> Fuck me sideways. <clears throat> Lancaster Peter. Another little bug is that the... you I probably spent... 700 but upgrading this gun and then the NPC has one of the shittiest guns in the game and and they'll just snipe you across the entire fucking county at least my time went up look at that and from that range To the range on these. The sidearm. This is weird. I don't know if I'm just having an off day or what. It's almost like they know I've got a time restraint and so they won't come out after me. You know what it is, too? It's this damn snow everywhere now. So it's lowering my cores. Doesn't seem to lower core stamina, though. This is a new thing. Benefits. I just wish they had one of these coupons get rid of all the damn snow. They should make, well, you make it whatever weather you want. I just have it raining constantly. Fuck the snow. <laughs> I 
He rides through, sees a bunch of dead revenue agents. Doesn't say a thing. One of my favorite things about the update is you can get like seven different outfits on your horse to carry around. Keep moving. That's one thing if you're fighting from horseback. That's no ability you get from bounty hunter missions. Riding to the side of your horse. It's pretty awesome. And it throws off their aim and then you can pop back up and headshot. Almost close enough to do an execution, but he started backing up. The other thing on, with this gun is the rate of fire. You can fan faster than any other gun in this game. I think at least 50% of the collectibles I found for the Madame Nazar were from looting um, bodies. Snow in a fucking swamp? Come on. That's what you get for maxing out uh, the bounty hunter missions. All the tricks with both weapons. Just got that after two months of playing. Probably could have done it sooner, but I was playing other games and I was trying to do all three rolls at the same time. But I got all those, so now I'm just focused on the Moonshiner. Which also... just unlocked. Oh, it's in melee. Flammable Moonshine. This is one of the best things in the entire game. That's my pyromaniac side speaking, but I can pour moonshine. And it's only 20 bucks for a full jug of this. Not the most realistic physics, but all you do is shoot it. I do wish the fire would last longer and cause more damage, but they they did really well visually with it. You can see it when it first starts lighting the blue. So they call these this bureau revenue agents. I can't remember the exact name of the bureau that was specifically tasked with the destruction of alcohol during the Prohibition in 1919, but this is the same people about 30 years after the after Wild West, give or take. That's when Prohibition starts. There's the proper way to dismount a horse there. The missions <coughs> reduce the cost of the mash for your still. But it's still 30 bucks. It must be prohibition if that's what they're charging just for mash to put in the still. Fucking hell. Yes, ma'am. I sure can. So I don't give a damn. All the snow forcing everyone to get winter outfits. 
I'm just gonna wait it out. No weapons. I'm gonna put on my scarecrow bandana. I'm actually glad that the bounty hunter missions are done. Doing all the dirty work for the law and we're back on the outlaw stuff. For sheriffs just sitting there. Offices. Especially that strawberry sheriff. That guy's a fucker. You do his job for him and then he talks shit. Oh man. Well, I guess we're doing this sober. Start with big boy. Then move on to the easier guys. Whole neighborhood's getting involved. Got someone's attention. It's like a mix between Warren Beatty and the... What's that guy's name? Fuck it! <sighs> now can I buy a drink? There's a cat! Another one of the few issues I have. <laughs> you can't pet them. And you can't have them as pets. The game's a little biased. Why is it so choppy? Fuck my internet speeds. It's all this damn snow. I'm dreaming of a 90 degree Christmas just like the ones I've never known so too polite for my own damn good so what is my honor? oh it's getting too high is just tap dancing in the doorway. I wish in real life the process of cleaning guns was that quick and easy. Alright girl. Enough tap dancing. We got some stuff to do. Lemoyne Raiders? Nope. Jumping around on tombs. I don't have any respect. Guess I better end them. Oh, you want execution, huh? Got my revolver under his chin and blew his head off, but his, his boyfriend tried, crawled up my ass with a sort of shotgun. See this reload? Uh, can't tell. Before it looked like he was using the the built-in ramrod under the barrel, which would be like reloading six muskets, which also means what he just did is superficially fast reload, unless it's modified to fit cartridges. Which is basically what they're saying. In which case, he wouldn't be using the underbarrel ramrod. Former Confederate militia. But those guys, I've never seen them do anything that below the belt. That guy's just paying respects to someone he lost, and they. Who knows what the hell they were doing? It's not like they robbed him and left. They were still there. Thanks. 
Shit your pants. Let my anger get the better. He's not even armed. What was he gonna do? Piss his pants and then take him off, whip him with it like a wet towel. Got a bunch of goodies for my gypsy lover. Looks like my ha hair pomade is still working. Oh, what's she doing out there? She's clear up in the mountains. She's gonna freeze to death out there. Damn it. Okay. I'm always respectful and polite of uh, other players unless they start something. As you can see, my hostility is always low and... But if they start stuff, I finish it. Someone had their flag lowered, and I've never raided anyone else's camp. So I just wanted to see what would happen when I shot the NPC crips of someone else's camp, and then just rode off. I'll pay more for the home set. But that's the extent of our conversation. I'd like to get to know her. But anyway, I don't know how that works. How, if Crips just respawns or what. But I thought it was funny. I honestly did him a favor. That character is so damn annoying. She needs to eat. Those freaking weeds and shit. She doesn't need to eat that. Damn it, she's a horse. She needs hay or a carrot. Superior breed Arabians. What is she doing? Okay. Superior, I guess for Christmas or whatever the hell. 